We are at the National Quartet Convention with me, the members of the Concords, and standing right next to me, Doug Miller. And Doug, welcome to Gospel Music well, thank Today. thank you very much. Glad to be here. I'm going to ask you to introduce the rest of the group. Okay, right beside me is uh, my wife of 24 years, Pat. Hi. And then my oldest daughter is Elizabeth. And then the twin daughters, that's Ashley and that's Amber. All the Miller girls there. Now tell me, the, there's a, a history to the Concord name. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, the Concords uh, used to be in Nashville for many years. Uh, uh, Jim Black, uh, I think he's president of CSAC or something like that in Nashville, sang gospel music, and uh, Wiley Shepard and a couple other guys used to be in the Concords in the early 70s. Uh, me and some young men uh, come together in the early 80s and we started a group and we come across the name and and we bought it off uh, the guys in Nashville and we sung as the concourse through the 80s full time for for many years and then um, then I bought them out and brought them to southern Ohio where me and my wife started singing we sung uh, up into the early 90s and then uh, we started having a family so we come off the road and and uh, got in church you know and raised their family and as they got older they got in college they said dad we need to start singing more than what we have been so in the last couple of years we uh, took off singing and the lord has just blessed tremendously yes that's that's really really good let me ask um pat what were you interested in southern gospel music when you grew up did you find out about it later how did that happen well, I've always sung Southern Gospel music with my family, and um, I've actually sung since I was four years old. And um, I just kept singing, playing a few instruments, things like that, and God kind of led me to Doug, and I bettered him. <laughs> <laughs> and um, then as he said, we started having children. Um, that's all they've known, Southern Gospel music, and that's kind of their heart's desire as well. So yes, I've sung go Southern Gospel all my life. Mm -hmm. So you didn't travel while the girls were, were young. No, we stay, we're from the southern part of Ohio, so we, we stayed locally, you know, and, and really got involved with our church and different things. We held, uh, you know, many offices in the church, and they were always part of it, but we always sang as a family. Um, a few years ago, we was at a basketball game at our high school, and uh, they didn't have anybody to sing the national anthem, so they asked us to do that, and we sung it in harmony, you know, the parts, and the people just... Um, really took to that. They wouldn't even hardly play a game without us singing. So it went from there and then we went to the districts and regionals singing and it's like 14,000 people. So a lot of people want to know who that group was singing the national anthem. So um, it just kind of snowballed from there. People want to know, will you come to our church and everything. And it just, uh, well, here we are today at National Quartet Convention and it's just uh, growing, you know, every month. It just keeps the, continuing to grow. And one of the few Southern Gospel groups that has to pay royalties to Francis Scott Key, I guess. Right. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Worked out well. Anyway, what's your major in college? Um, I'm actually triple majoring. I'll graduate in May from the University of Rio Grande, which is just a little college in southeastern Ohio, um, with an associate's in communications, a bachelor's in mass communications, and a bachelor's in public relations. So I have my hands full, but I enjoy it. Do you think you'll keep singing? Yeah, I really plan on keep um, keeping singing, uh, to keep singing, I can't talk, sorry. Um, I do a lot of the PR work for the group, and so I'd like to kind of keep yeah. keep them hand in hand. What's your college major? Um, I'm actually, the title of my college major is Adolescent to Young Adult Integrated Language Arts. Big name, meaning I will be a high school English teacher. <laughs> so I absolutely love it. Okay. That's, that's what I used to be in my previous life. Good choice, good choice. <laughs> yes, I enjoy it. Who's your favorite uh, Southern Gospel singer? Well, I'm torn between Ernie Haas and, Sin and Signature Sound. That's my favorite group, but my favorite singer is Lauren Talley of the Talley Trio. What's your college major? Uh, mine is actually Adolescent to Young Adult History, so I'll be a high school history teacher. Um, and we actually all three go to the same university, so that's kind of cool, all three of us on the same campus. So. And uh, have you been recording? Yeah, we're working on a brand new CD right now. We just had a um, brand new single go out a couple weeks ago, uh, a Gerald Crabb song, uh, which we was excited to find. Nobody had recorded it, so um, uh, God's not finished with me yet. And it's getting uh, uh, real good reviews, and we're looking for a, a real good run with this song. Great, great. 
good choice with Gerald Crabb. <laughs> yeah, he does a fine job. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Concord's website? Yeah, www.concordsmusic.com. Okay. To all the members of the Concords, thank you very much for being with us on Gospel Music today. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thanks thank you. for having us. Enjoy your show. There's more coming up on Gospel Music Today.